Good morning guys, it's Saturday. I actually just got an early start because I'm up anyway, so I'm going to feed the horses and get them on their way. As you can see, we are surrounded in mud. Makes it really difficult to do a cleanup of the yard right now because if you drive a tractor, you're just going to be sinking in the mud. So hopefully by the end of this month, everything will be dry enough that we can start building our outdoor arena. I've already called around, uh, got some prices, got some footing, uh, so we know what we're gonna get now. It's just a matter of leveling off the land with the tractor and getting it done. Well, I did it. I managed to put them all up myself, which wasn't that much trouble. So what I did was I just fed Storm and Finn out the back first. And I let them out and I just let one, I just let Finn out and Storm just followed me there. And then I put Stella and Willow's hay out and they were just over there enjoying breakfast with the boys. That was super simple. I think they're getting used to each other. Oh, hi, there you guys are. Today we're doing something completely different. We are leaving this little farm that we call home and heading out into the big wide world. It's true, we are doing something completely different. We are leaving the farm. Only one thing is so important that it can take us away from our beloved herd. Yard sale season. Guess what I'm gonna get today? What? Spike and pigment and slime. Nothing. I'm gonna get everything, even baby dolls. If you guys have been following this channel for any length of time, then you guys know that we are hardcore about our yard sales. And it's finally time for us to go out there and see what kind of treasures we can find. You just heard from the experts, Gabby is the girl who comes home empty handed all the time and Sophie is the girl who comes home with everything she finds. Sam and I like to put out into the atmosphere what we are expecting to find and I would love to find anything horse related yeah. or it's all farmers here too. Yeah, it's all farmers in this area. So anything that we could decorate our barn with would be good for me. What are you hoping to find? <sighs> Tractor stuff. What are you hoping to find? Slime, pigment, everything with slime, and um, toys, and uh, schleich, and everything. What are you hoping to find? Horse things. All right, let's do it. First here, Taya. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Look at that stuff. I like that stuff in the store window. Oh my god, I know what you're gonna buy. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Water barrel. I love a good water barrel. We could cut that in. I love a good rake. I love, love a good crock pot. Look, I found a bag. You found a bag? Oh, I love it. Hi, how are you? Good. What's that bag for? That is just, I, I, I have another one and it goes in the back of my car. Oh, and okay. You put grocery bags in it or it could be for anything. You want those? I think they're really cute too. Sit down in it and see how you like it. So funky. I'd like it better on our porch. Ooh, super cool. Go find out how much these babies are. Okay, first one to buy something. Not me, not you. I wanted to buy Not you, but the girl who never buys anything. New record. New. My mom bought it for me. Yeah, so new record. Next purchase goes to Sophie, and what'd you get, Sophie? A pump and a bouncy ball. No, I should, we have to share this one since you already no. have one. No, yes. I have a miniature size. One. We're definitely going to share it because it's going to be a for our horses if it works out that way. Um, maybe we can get a cover for it and make it more horsey. And it's so good for exercising, which we've been kind of trying to do a little bit which more mom? of. I mostly exercise. And um, then, like, if I do 25 sit ups, then Gabby will do it just to prove she can do 26. So it's working. Look at this new Is it a mini? Or is it a pony? Cut 
the length of it because it's just the length. And the these are like smaller because the other ones are like that length. They're cute. Smaller, so Look at this. Cool. They're leather. What about oh, this? Shoot, I lost. Horse mane cone. We don't have one. Sheet, 64. How big is what? How big is Finn? Uh, He's a cob. 64 thing. inches, so don't. So that's how you don't. So did you guys check any of these things? What are these? Those are girth covers. Oh, girth covers. Yeah, I really want this. I think. I mean, why would you ever use a white one, though? Because. And none of these saddle pads will fit our horses? Yeah. So, Sophia, your girth goes in here. Yeah, so Sophie's is a small girth. Beauty products? Never How much are they? I don't know. They are two dollars each or three for five. Cool. Smells like a farm down here. Oh, you're putting on pony rocks? Ha, Stella. Today, Sam came down with Sophie, and it was their turn to do chores. And tomorrow it's me and Gabby, which I love because we saved the best day. Tomorrow's supposed to be warm and sunny. I did find a Gabby Spurs in the car, yeah. and a bag. I didn't check the trailer, but I'm suspecting there's some stuff in the trailer. No, inside this bag are all Storm's bell boots. What? Oh. So Gabby's spurs have been taken away from her. She has two pairs of spurs. She's not allowed to ride them. And there, is, there are stuff missing from our other barn. I'm gonna have to go and look in the trailer because I know we had one of these things and it's not here. Riding gloves, which are amazing. Bell boots. Um, all her bell boots, which I know she's gonna wanna put on Storm. She couldn't find hers the other day. The farrier wanted Storm to wear them. A boot, like one random boot. We need that, obviously. So a lot. Of, some of you guys are very disturbed and upset that we blanketed uh, Finn. That we chose to blanket Finn in a really bad uh, weather situation where he did not have any shelter to get out of the rain. Some horses I know definitely like being in the rain. He does not. Um, and they're probably going to be even more disturbed to see that we are going to use fly blankets this summer to keep our horses protected from the flies. Um, and so we did buy this one. It was uh, like such a good deal and I'm not sure if it's gonna fit him. We're gonna try it though. There are some other cool things at that one yard sale, but they were kind of junky. Like they had a braiding kit, like a bunch of stuff for braiding. Um, and we already have all that, so we didn't get that. So if he's riding the ball. So bringing Storm back has uh, given us back our little tiny arena because the horses don't want to be in here now. They want to all be out there so they can watch Storm. Uh, so if we get, somebody got some pony wraps, Gabby, some purple ones. What did we learn about polo wraps? Those are short. What did we learn about them, even if they're too big? We can cut them. So we're going to be cutting those to fit Willow because they're purple. At this point, we don't really know how to put them on safely. Um, regular, like we don't, we don't, yeah. I know, but we're not awesome at it yet, so uh, we just use them for like pictures and stuff. Like we're not going to be moving our horses around while we use them, but we are collecting them because one day, as the girls grow, we will get better and better at using them. One of my favorite things ever is that the girls and I spend so many hours every single day down in the barn. All of us doing our own separate things, and it makes me super happy to be together doing what we love and not be in the house on our electronics. It's amazing. If you are worried about your kids being inside on the computer, get a horse. It is actually raining a bit. I see a storm 
blankets in the trailer. Ah, first aid kit, broom, and some other stuff up there. Things that I will be working on this week are a first aid kit for the trailer. This is all we have so far. We are kind of building up our first aid kit. We have two little boxes. Um, I also have some, this is iodine. Um, I also have some banamine. I ordered a big, huge bottle of banamine that's gonna come soon. I have some antibiotics. I have some butte as well. So things are shaping up. Um, definitely want to uh, compile all of it together in one spot so we can just grab a box and go when we need to um, and add obviously a few more things. Yeah, but you know, I find that you learn as you go. Most people I think that's what happens is that you learn as you go. You buy the things you need as you need them and then you compile them and keep them all together. But yeah, I definitely feel a little bit better that we have some stuff though. Like before, whenever anything would happen to Storm at the other barn, we'd be like, oh gee, what should we do now? And then we'd have to like run out and get stuff. So, I mean, we have a lot of vet wrap, a lot of bandages, a lot of um, antiseptic. We have a variety of sponges and syringes, some antibiotic lotions. The weirdest thing just happened. I am on chores. Tonight, Gabby and I, we're on turn in. So I told the girls, I'm gonna do chores, like get the water out, get the hay out, get the food out, and they can get their horses and saddle up and we'll go for a ride. And it's been like 20 minutes and I hear no sounds. I think they're missing. Aww. I love it. You guys getting your horses ready? Do you want me to come stand over here so that uh, the mares don't try and get through? Oh. Just an FYI, these girls have been standing vid vigil over the boys for days now. They have not been in the arena. They just stand where it's driest. Okay, what do you need? Oh, you did? Okay, so can we take five seconds to acknowledge how amazing that horse and that girl are because he trusts her more than anything on earth. Sophie, that's what you need to do with him. Oh. So yesterday I was trying to unhook this and come through the gate. And Gabby's like, mom, just undo the bottom one and climb through. So I was like, okay, I'll do that. So I undid the bottom one and I climbed through and I started walking and then Finn was watching me. Yeah, and Finn was like, oh, she can do that, I can do it. The next thing I know, I hear clonk, clonk, clonk and Finn charges through the, the fence. He literally tried to duck his head underneath this one and come through the bottom just like I did. And yeah, it worked out fine. He just clumped through. But yeah, Finn, trouble. He wants Stella. How are you feeling, Stella? She seems pretty calm, pretty relaxed. Everything with horses is five million years. I literally sit in this little spot. Sam, you need to build me like a big bench here because I literally sit here for hour after hour every day while the girls fix their horses before we can ride. Finn is being a brat and Sophie's trying to remind him that he's a horse and she's the leader. You make him gallop. He wants to move his feet, you make you him gallop. You make him move his feet more. Yeah, that's what Gabby's doing, teaching Sophie all her good habits. Uh, that's what I do with Storm and then after he's like, bye mom. Yeah, that is what you did with Storm. So this funny story, Storm, Loves Gabby so much. One time we went, Sam and I, to meet the farrier to do Storm's feet, and Storm was the worst horse ever. And the farrier is like, yeah, this is the worst horse ever. Like, he wasn't horribly bad, like he wasn't trying to kick him or anything like Stella did one time. And um, he just was acting up, acting up, acting up. Like he just, and we were like doing all the things that Gabby does to him, and he is like, you are not the boss of me. And then Gabby walks into the room, and literally his head goes down and he's like so calm. Like he just gets calm with her. Yeah, you're literally just walking two horses. So Storm is 15 2 and Finn is 14 2. Yeah. All right, let's get these babies groomed.
Guys, remember when we were at Molly and Chloe's and we wanted a little barn like theirs? And even though ours is not as nice as theirs yet, but like we actually have like a little, little barn to play in. Stop biting me. Stop eating me. Storm got the ball out. You want to play? Want me to run with you and play? You'll find a different side of me. The one I'd like to be. A different side of me, yeah. You'll find a different side of me. Like someone pretty neat. A different side of me, yeah. No stop signs Counting down till we take flight It's how you make me feel Yeah, yeah Let's call in sick and be lazy I'm all for doing what's crazy Cause you make it real, yeah You'll find a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah You like it when it goes fast? I can feel that you're changing me. Day by day got me shedding skin. The layers have peeled away. Got me moving through time and space. Your magic can be erased. to be a different side of me yeah e -e 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 -e. you'll find a different side of me like someone pretty need a different side of me yeah e -e 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 -e. The future home of Finn and Storm. You'll find a different side of me, the one I'd like to be, a different side of me, yeah. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.